بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله Since the Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم start his message the people attacking the Islam and the Muslims those people honestly they have no idea what is the Islam means or what is the Muslims want God created us all of us from one soil the soil of Prophet Adam peace be upon him this man came once he, his name Peter King a few days ago and he started speaking about the Islams and the Muslims and the leaders one of his statements he said that the Muslims community leaders needs to speak out more loudly against the terrorism and work more closely with the police, police and the FBI I don't understand what the Muslims community is not enough what we are doing and speaking to the world against terrorism we say it clearly again we are against terrorism God said in the Quran in many ayat in many verses that we are against terrorism God says it clearly in the Quran if you kill one innocent soul just like you kill the whole humanity if you make one person alive you make all the humanities alive that is clear but those people in my opinion they are ignorance completely ignorance what is the Islam is means what the Muslims want we are speaking loudly and loudly and loudly we are against terrorism we are against what going what happened in New York we are against it 100 percent and so on and so on and this man came suddenly and he start to speaking about the Islam and the Muslims honestly he want to be famous as he said clearly in another statement he said this hearings maybe make me famous for a week He's not a famous, he's an ignorant famous, nothing else but that. This man and the man in, in Florida and whoever is speaking against the Islam and the Muslims, go back and speaking about the Islam and the Muslims. And also I blame, I blame and I blame all the leaders, Muslim leaders here. They have to speak more loudly against those kind of people what they, are, they have to learn about the Islam and the Muslims. Those leaders, they not, should not be afraid of anything to speak about what is the Islam really means. What did the Muslims ex exactly want? We are not against any religion. In fact, the Islam order me to believe in Christianity, to believe in the Jewish religion. Is the Islam order me that? Order me to believe in Jesus? Order me to believe in Abraham and Moses and so on? All the prophets, 25 prophets mentioned in the Quran and I have to believe in them. And this man suddenly come because he is the chairman of the office of homeland security. He speak whatever he wants, and he stop and prevent whoever he wants from the Congress to speak out. Yes, my dear brothers and sisters, Muslims and non-Muslims, we have to speak more aloud. What did the Islams mean? The reality about the Islams, the reality about the Muslims, and the, the Islams is not only peace. And we have to work. The Islam is the, a way of life. In fact, it is the way, the way of life, it is the Islam and the Muslims. Go back and learn about the Islam and the Muslims before you start to claim and abuse and accuse all kinds of Islams and Muslims. My dear leaders, Muslims and Imams in every community, speak aloud and teach the others. Teach the others about the Islam. And do not be afraid of anything as far as you're saying the truth, nothing but the truth about the Islams, about the Muslims. God created us to worship Him. Muslims and non-Muslims and all kind of humanity, God created us to worship Him, to believe in Him, and to use all those favors and bounties around. That's what we're supposed to do, my dear brothers and sisters. We are in America, 10 million Muslims is not minority. We are not minority. We are American just like everybody else. We are in the same ship, in one ship, all of us together. We're supposed to arrive to, to the coast together, united, hand by hand. Hand by hand, Muslims and non-Muslims, to save the country, to protect the country, to defend the country. I mean the United States of America, then we must work together, not against each other. We're supposed to be united together, not against each other. 
for those people like Peter King and the man in Miss Florida and so on and so on, go learn first before you speak about Islam. Go read, read and repeat myself, read about the Islam the Muslims before you say anything about the Islam and the Muslims. Not because you have a position, you say whatever you want. No, we have to stop you because your salary from my pocket as an American, from every American's pocket, it is your salary. Then you have to speak the truth, nothing but the truth. Not to be a famous. We make you a famous. We put you in this position. So you speak the truth, nothing but the truth. May Allah, God, guide all of us to the right path. Amen. Assalamu alaikum. Oh, oh, oh.